On the ballot for voters in Stockton is the race for mayor. There are six candidates in all, and KCRA3's Orko Mana shows us three of them yesterday. Yeah, and today Orko introduces us to the other three candidates and asks them about their top priorities. With just days until the California primary, three more candidates for Stockton mayor are sitting down with KCRA3. Their levels of political experience vastly different. Tom Patty has served on the County Board of Supervisors for several years. I've got a record of 20, 30 things that I've initiated into San Joaquin County that have had a profound difference. Now's the time to bring it to the city. Christina Fugazi is a longtime educator with Stockton Unified and was previously on the city council. So I have have quite a bit of experience in truly understanding how government works. Shaquille Ahmed has never held public office before but says he can connect with voters. I've been in business for almost 18 years, a successful businessman and a successful uh, social worker. Despite their different backgrounds, Patty and Ahmed have the same top issue, homelessness. Data shows there are around 900 unhoused people in Stockton, so what should be done? You pivot away from housing first, which is not the answer for everybody. And if we have shelter beds, then we can put together a crisis response teams, get people off the streets, engage with them, and bring them to a place of stability. Teach them, you know, like, um, give them some, uh, show them some um, um, skills, so when they come out, you know, they can stand on their own feet. And once we see that they're ready, they can go, we can just let them go. How would you tackle homelessness in Stockton? We need to make sure that we have some transitional housing or housing in general for those individuals that merely don't have housing because they've been priced out of the market. Fugazi says her number one priority is addressing crime. Do you have a plan or ideas of how you would go about you know, working with the community, within the community to work on violence prevention. Our kids, our kids are who we have to get to. And then mentorship programs, job opportunities. I was thinking of two days a week, two hours after school to be working at one of the area businesses and maybe not go out and do things that they probably shouldn't do. Ahmed and Patty also want to focus on the youth. Can you give me specific examples of what kind of youth programs you would create? There are so many trades, you know, we can uh, teach them. When they don't see that opportunity, they just want to see the, the easy way. And the easy way is the, the crime. Vocational education, job training, nothing's going to improve the not only quality of life, but, but lessen the degree of, of criminal activity and graffiti and all the blight than a job. That job's going to make a difference, and you give kids a hope, a gateway. In terms of responding to crime, the three candidates say they would work in collaboration with the Stockton Police Department and other city and county leaders to boost the number of officers on the streets. Quality of life and rejuvenating downtown also top of mind for the candidates. We could create an epicenter of economy. How about we bring in a, a convention center, a hotel, music venue, family entertainment. Rolling out the red carpet to individuals that want to bring a business here that's going to provide livable wage jobs. I believe in practical work. I want to see work done on the streets. All candidates believe they're the right person to be Stockton's next mayor. I am somebody that does the work. I'm hands on. I roll up my sleeves. I will go to the, you know, to the common people, you know, like their businesses. I will on regular basis. One distinct difference between myself and others running for mayor is results. Reporting in Stockton, Orco Mana, KCRA 3 News. And the race for Stockton mayor could be decided with the March 5th primer if one candidate gets more than 50% of the votes. If not, the top two candidates will face off during the November election. To learn about all six Stockton mayoral candidates, head to KCRA.com or the KCRA3 app. We've got it all up there for you. Um